corner for the corner three. Derek Castor hits that three Flores, laro lang ng bata umatake at dosin na. So we have a front kick on Uber in Sydney. On Uber, throwing up a triple. Serosev is not known as a three-point shooter. Pero ito si Brot. Hindi na papasok ito ng Lefra Heights. Ilagan for three. Ilagan is on fire. Long distance three. Ginamita pala banta. Ilis na pala. Nagpabalik ang pinakaunang collegiate basketball league sa Pilipinas dito lamang sa Phil Loyal Flying V Center sa lungsod ng San Juan para sa isang anumang paghahandog ng NCAA Season 93. Araw po ng Martes ngayon, kakabalik lang natin galing sa long weekend at sisimula namin ang inyong uh, linggo sa isang doubleheader huling araw po ng first round of eliminations dito sa NCAA. Unang magharap. JRU Heavy Bombers, red hot team right now, won three games in a row. They are gonna go up against the struggling Mapua University Cardinals for our first game today. Pagkatapos po niyan, it is gonna be the rematch of last year's finals. The Sun Better Red Lions, our defending champions, will be in action against the Arellano University Chiefs. Yan po ang ating doubleheader for today, August 29, 2017. And uh, you guys are watching live on SNA, SNA HD, the Filipino channel, TFC.TV and sports.abs-cbn.com. At kasama po ang mga high school students mula sa Jose Rizal University. Ayan po, inihintay na ang maglaro ang kanilang kupunan. Ako po si Martin Avier, naglilingkod sa inyo ngayong hapon na ito. At kasama ko rin si uh, isa pang Martin, si uh, Strengths and Conditioning Specialist. Nandito si Coach Hammer, Martin Antonio. Coach, magandang hapon sa'yo. Magandang hapon sa'yo, Martin. Magandang hapon mga kapamilya. Tulad ng ating mga high school students sa JRU, excited na rin tayo na panoorin muli ang pagbabalik ng NCAA dahil nagkaroon nga tayo ng mahabang weekend. Opposite sides tayo dito sa dalawang kupunan. JRU, mainit na mahinit. Dito sa ating season, 1-3 games in a row. Mabuo naman. Napakalamig. They've lost six games in a row. So they wanna, you know, get out of this slump and, uh, you know, get back on the winning track. Samantala, speaking of the winning tracks, tignan natin muna natin, uh, Coach Martin, kung nasaan ang uh, dalawang kupo ng ito sa ating team standings. Napakatamis ng tatlong sunod-sunod na panalo na yun ng JRU Heavy Bombers. Ngayon sila ay mag-isa sa number three spot. Gusto nilang mas hawakan pa yan para maganda ka nilang kartada. Papasok sa second round. Kung gaano katamis ang kanilang tatlong panalo, ganun naman kaalat yung anim na sunod-sunod na pagkatalo nitong Mapua Cardinals. Nakausap natin kayo na si Coach Atoy ko na medyo mas bumabaw pa ang kanyang rotation. Makikita natin ngayon kung maaapula niya yung sunod-sunod na pagkatalo ngayong season 93. At ito nga, dito sa ating team standings, we are officially approaching the halfway mark of the season dahil nga ito ang huling araw ng first round of eliminations. Pero puntahan muna natin ang uh, JRU Heavy Bombers. Nabanggit natin ang kanilang winning streak. All of those uh, three games, they won in double digit. Uh, 28, 29, at 11 point lead. And last time against San Sebastian, ginawa pa nila yon sa harap ng home crowd ng Baste. At sino pa ba ang pumutok? kundi ang uh, bata ng San Juan na si Tete Teodoro. First half, medyo malamig siya. Second half, doon na bumulusok itong si Tete. Dabing isang puntos na pagkapanalo para sa JRU Heavy Bombers. Kinuha nila yung bahay ng mga Golden Stags. Nakita natin, Tete Teodoro, isang puntos kada minuto ang ibinigay niya. Mahigit pala sa isang puntos kada minuto. Labing siyam na puntos. Mababa ang kanyang field goal shooting. 5 out of 14. Nakabawi siya sa free throws. Limang na-shoot niya sa anim na attempts. 
sa labing walong minuto. Martin, napakaganda no, napaka-efficient. Kumbaga, bawat hawak niya ng bola, bawat minuto, nagdadagdag siya ng isang puntos para sa kanilang kuponan. Tete Tudora, as you can see, uh, your stats on your screens, 18 minutes, 19 points, 5 out of 14 from the field. Let's see if he can do that against the uh, Mapua University Cardinals. And uh, puntahan naman natin yung kabilang side ng uh, kuponan, yung makakalaban nila ngayon, Mapua University for Coach Atoy Ko. Again, they are only 8-man deep. Uh, ngayong araw na ito, nagsimula sila ng season 11-man rotation sila. Walo na lang sila ngayon dahil nga tatlong player yung na-injure pero hindi sila susuko. Nakita natin yon nung laban nila against the LPU Pirates at yung mga talagang inaasahan ni Coach Atoy ko e eh, nag-deliver naman para sa kanya despite the loss. Tatlong players ang may labing tatlong puntos mahigit. Yan si Christian Bunyag, JB Raflores at JP Nieles. Maganda ang kinilang inilaro nun compared sa ibang teams na nakalaban nga ng LPU Pirates nung first half, tiktikan pa ng laban. Naubusan lang talaga sila ng gasolina towards the second half. Doon talaga umalagwa itong mga LPU Pirates. Tinatalo sila doon, 97 to 74. Yun yung nagbigay sa kanila ng kanilang ika-anim na talo. Nawala pa si Keith sa kanila nung game na yun. Um, Andoy Estrella, nursing an MCL injury. Makikita natin ngayon kung paano pa mag adjust itong uh, lineup na medyo mababaw nga para kay Coach Atoy ko. Yan nga, magiging challenge para dito sa kapunan ni Coach Atoy ko. Bunyag, nakikita nyo on your screen, is second in the league in rebounding right now at 11.9 per game. Sana may pagpatuloy niya yan against the JRU Heavy Bombers. Which, is it, incidentally, Coach Martin is the number one defensive team in the league right now. So, napakahirap na task ito na makakuha ng panalo towards the end of the first round. Pero, bago tayo magpatuloy sa ating coverage, puntahan muna natin at kilala na ng ikatlong member ng ating broadcast team. Nandiyan si Sarah Carlos. Sarah? Hi, Martin. Hi, Coach Hammer. I'm so happy we're all working together again. Alala niyo pa ba kanong tawag natin sa isa't isa before? Eminem! Oh, Eminem! Kala ko nakalimutan mo na eh. Anyway, guys. To everyone who's watching right now, I'm here to give you our question of the day. So, kung nasa bahay kayo, nanonood kayo ng game, which, by the way, you can also watch live. Just head on over to sports.abs-cbn.com slash livestream slash NCAA. So, wala na kayong excuse to miss today's game. So, again, our question of the day is, sino ang player ang gusto mong manood na maglaro this Friday sa NCAA All-Star Game? Huwag nyo kalimutan gamitan ang aming official hashtags. Hashtag NCAA Strong and hashtag NCAA Season 93. Of course, syempre, I'm sure may sagot siya ng ating panel. Martin and Coach Hammer, anong sagot nyo? Ikaw muna, Sarah. Ako muna? Um, <laughs> wait, kayo muna mag-isip. Ah, sige, sige, eh. sige. Mamaya sa coverage. Pero, <laughs> meron akong katabi ngayon na masasagot nyo yung tanong. Ito si Celine. Isa siyang senior high school student mula dito sa JRU. Uh, Celine, hello ka muna sa mga fans mo. Hello. Okay, Celine, sino ba yung gusto mong player na makita mo uh, sa ating All-Star Game ngayong biyernes? Putucci from Heavy Bumper. Si Putucci. Bakit si Putucci yung gusto mo makita? Ang galing niya kasi. Ang galing niya kasi. Sure ka na kay Abdel Putucci. Okay, meron na tayong isang vote para kay Abdel Putucci. Sana ito makabuse sa kanyang confidence at makipagpagpakita ang gila siya sa atin ngayong larong ito. Pero ito na, sa ating pagbabalik, laban na po. First game of the day, JRU Heavy Bombers and Mapua University Cardinals. Huwag kayong aalis, magbabalik ang live coverage ng Season 93 ng inyo NCAA. Dito lamang sa SNA. Carl Borda, point guard. Jed Mendoza, shooting guard. Abdul Sawad, forward. John Grospe, forward. Abdul Wahab, center. Jay Pinelles, point guard. Lawrence Victoria, point guard. Cedric Plyo, shooting guard. Daniel Aguirre, forward. Christian Bunyag, center. Nagbabalik tayo dito sa season 93 ng inyong NCAA at kinalanin na natin ang starting lineup para sa parehong kupunan for Coach uh, Brihal Meneses. Same lineup that he's been applying uh, at least in the past few games for him. Sa kabila naman, Coach Martin, nine man deep na pala sila ngayon because Cedric Pilayo is uh, back in the lineup, the rookie out of Canada for uh, Coach Ato Iko in action, shooting up today and is in the starting lineup. Nakausap ko siya before the game and asked him if he's uh, fully healthy so that he's good to go. And we saw he's really good to go in game speed. 
as a coach for him. That will be uh, the adjustment, the main adjustment for Cedric Palayo in this game. Getting his, his uh, rhythm back against the JR. You have the Bombers. Comes up Palayo now in first quarter, first percentage goes to the heavy Bombers. It'll be interesting to see how they will uh, play this game out. Mendoza, Sumalaksa, right away, laying it up and in. Martin Zed Mendoza has been playing really well against the Nila Naru niya ngayong taon. Siya yung nagdadagdag ng mga puntos paulan-ulan dito para kay Coach Virgil Meneses at sa JRU Heavy Bombers. Jed Mendoza is the second leading scorer in this JRU squad, averaging 12 points per game. Telayo, missing on his first shot. First game back, the Bunyag right there gets the offensive rebound. Chris Pelayo again from the baseline. No good. Bunyag to offensive boards right away. But the Bombers will get it back. Here's Abdul Sawat, another revelation for Coach for Helmineses this season for Don. Missing from the outside. Here come the Cardinals. Victoria with speed with a left hand right, as well. Martin, alam mo makikita naman natin ang mapuwa Cardinals. Every game strong start sila. At dun naman ka nag-isa dulo eh. Dahil konti rin ang tao nakakalaro sa kanila konti ang rotations. Dun sila nauubos talaga. Sabi nga niya, Coach Asoy ko kanina, nasa dugout tayo. Wala namang problema. Yung sistema nila at saka ni Coach Ed. Yun nga lang talagang nauubos sila. At talaga. Pero ito, hindi pagsabayan sila sa panimula. Ngayon ang ating uh, laro. Four all po. Two baskets for each team. Mendoza, Bordon, back to Mendoza outside. Palik kay Bordon, na libre. And hard Bordon drains that jump shot. That is a three-pointer first one of the game for the Heavy Bombers. Delayo. Bringing the ball up. Nieles. Against the taller Sawat. Binali kay Victoria sa labas. Victoria flips it up. Off the glass. No good. Sawat with a board. Bordon. Tumatakbo. Decides to slow it down. They swing the ball around. They get it to Broste. Oh, try to lob it to Abdul Rasak Abdul Wahab. But Bordon rather will get it back. Step back J for Broste. Masyado malakas. Pelayo gets it to uh, Victoria. Almost a backward violation right there. Victoria. Tanga ng bola. Nakita si Niele sa kanto. No good. Pelayo gets the offensive board. They will reset Pelayo from the corner. Oh! Cedric Pelayo! Welcome Three. back to the NCAA, Cedric Pelayo. Good run down. Pagkakuha niya ng offensive rebound. Just to the guard, maganda yung relocation ni J.P. Nieles, hinatak pa taas fitting in sa corner, Pelayo with a 3-pointer you guys are wondering, I think Pelayo only played 2 games before he uh, had that foot injury this is officially his 3rd game of the season Papi ka ng bola foul against Aguirre Vivo perfect shot, perfect selfie you can see Lawrence Victoria going coast to coast, finishing with the left hand and challenging even the defense of Abdul Yassam Abdul Wahab. Again, that was our Viva Perfect Shot, Perfect Selfie. Puntahan muna natin si Sarah Carlos. Sarah? Guys, sobrang, kagaya ng sinabi mo kanina, Coach Hammer, sobrang tamis ng pagkapanalo ng JRU Heavy Bombers for the past three games. So I took the liberty to interview Coach Rahel Menez and ask you why he thinks they were able to back these wins. As ang sabi niya sa akin, that he saw the improvement in the team's willingness to share, to, to protect the ball, to defend, and of course, to help one another. And of course, tinanong ko rin siya, ano tingin niya improvement sa kailangan to do better in the next round and he said that he still thinks that the team still needs to grow as both teams and for individuals. Back to you, Coach Hammer and Martin. Maraming salamat, Sarah. But, you know what? Maraming revelations para dito kay Coach Wilhelm Meneses this season. Nung na-injure si Darius Estrella na talagang inasaya. Speaking of options, this was their, one of their main gunners last season, si Paolo Pondejos. Pinapanood yung... Uh, kanyang uh, dating kupunan pero like the likes of Abdul Sawat 
Jet Mendoza. Yan yung mga nahanap niya this season na talaga nagko-contribute para sa kanila. And they've been coming up big in the past three games for Coach Ferhan Meneses. Martin, historically, ang JRU heavy bomber sa man. Hindi siya top heavy na school eh. Kung mga mga ilan yan lang, mga Marco Fajardo, si uh, Coach Nani Epondo lang ngayon ng San Sebastian Golden Stats. Sila yung mga talagang gunners dati. Pero they have been really strength in numbers. Mala Golden State yan eh. Maraming players ang nagbibigay sa'yo ng 6 to 8 points. At dun sila nagiging mas competitive instead of having a one-hand show. That is true, uh, Coach Martin. Team effort. Iga nga para dito si JR. You have the bombers. But JP Mieles. Drake from the other side. Gives Mabua. Takes off the lead. May timeout tayo dito. Magbabalik ang NCAA on SNA. Kapag tayo dito sa Season 93 ng inyong NCAA. Lawrence Victoria on your screens right now. Dished up a lot of assists. As well as the playing assistant coach of uh, JRU, J.O. Lasketi. They dished out a lot of assists in that game. Lasketi with nine assists against the uh, San Sebastian Golden Stags. Si uh, Victoria naman, nine assists then. Ang binigay niya against the LPU Pirates. That's how you win ball games. You share the ball. You find the guy who would play for other people. Filling out the stat sheet. Magkaiba man ang tinatahap nilang landas ngayon sa panalo at talo. At least nandun dun yung effort to involve your teammates. Gio Laschetti is number 7 in the league in uh, assists per game, 3.5. Victoria naman, number 9 at 3.4. So we can expect them to be at uh, the main facilitators for their respective teams this afternoon. Take off pass, Victoria. Hello, Nieles will reset. Nieles. Based pass. Vieke Gabo. Vieke Gabo. Swing it around. Nieles from the corner. No good. Bordon secures the rebound. Dul Sawat posting up. Vieke Grosle. Nice dish inside to Abdul Rasak. Abdul Wahab is unable to finish the gimme. With all his defensive uh, gifts, not not the softness of hands. Mm. Para dito kay uh, Abdul Rasak Abdul Wahab. Pero mintis sa kabila, Bordon. May tanga ng bola for JRU. Mendoza. 14 seconds to operate. Mendoza, binigay sa labas. Bordon. Attacking the defense and Nieles for done. Up and under move is good. You know your game plan, nila, Martin. Sabi kanina ni Coach Rahel, they would just outwork them. Dahil ba ang rotation ng Mapua Cardinals. Gusto nila trabaho in first quarter to fourth quarter. Dahil mapapago din yan. Yan na sabi ni Coach uh, Rahel Menezes. Sir, are in time. No signs of fatigue for uh, our Flores. Getting his first bucket off the game. So Mapua? Trading baskets with JRU here in this first quarter. Sawat goes baseline. Floater. No good. Field goes nothing. Kaplataya 5 out of 12 for both teams. Lorenz Victoria. Tumatakbo. Lorenz Victoria coast to coast. No good. That's the strength of the Papua Cardinals. Dahil ang natira na nga sa kanilang paniguarja. So they need to run. But pag tinatakbo naman nila, mas tumataas yung ano, work rate nila. Mas napapagod yung players. It's na uubusan si Zaki sa huli. So they need to figure out a way of the, uh, preserving their energy para sa latter parts of this game. Mendoza turnaround off the glass. No good. Mendoza gets it back. You will get the put back to go. Three-point lead for the JRU Heavy Bombers. We have a timeout here for Coach Ato Ikom Babalik in NCAA on SNA. The last day of the first round of eliminations, we don't forget the beautiful ngiti na nonood ngayon sa PILO and Flying B Center. Of course, ever-present are the students and uh, supporters of uh, these teams. First game, we have the JRU and uh, Papua supporters right now. Ay, kita nyo, ito mga taga JRU. A uniform pa? Sana hindi sila nag-cut? May attendance yan. May attendance. May, attendance. May additional uh, credits. credits. <laughs> Ayun naman. Of course, that works for uh, 
coach at schools that with more support, you're getting more uh, confidence boosters for your team. Goes both ways, mm -hmm. additional scores para sa yo. Exactly, and JP Mieres continuing his uh, splendid performance here in the first quarter, getting another bucket to go. He has four points and a turnover for JRU against Mark De La Virgen. Nakakapasok lang. He's got kick out from the book to JP Mieles, top of the jumper. Goes in to Layo. Loses the ball. Pero mananatili sa kanila ang bola with uh, 16 seconds on the shot clock. 16 seconds to shoot. La Flores shoots over Abdul Reza Abdul Wahab. Bella Virgen. They're swinging around to the other side. Mendoza penetrates, gets it to Abdul Reza Abdul Wahab again. With a miss in the paint. In a hand of Sira Flores. No post the anti Grosby. La Flores. Dream shake. Fade away is no good. Mendoza. We slow it down for JRU using the Abdul Rizak screen. Rigege Purdun Salabas Purdun gets free. Floater is no good. La Flores with a rebound. One minute, 14 seconds remaining here in the first quarter. As we see a turnover from Mapua. Their uh, third one off the game. Great defense there by Hasid Gabo running down, poking it at the right moment. Yes, Converting a jump shot going down. Hasid Gabo for his first two points off the ball game. And to end play. Gives him another taste off the lead, 15 to 14. Assist para sa Makua University Cardinals 2 mula sa JRU. Dila Berhen drains that three point bomb. So a two point lead for JRU. Gapo, the lob to Punyag. Punyag unable to finish underneath. Here we got the ball back and draw a foul on Abdul Raza Abdul Wahab. Listen, Punyag has been really a revelation. Ilo Nutriap, the link move off the border, that pull up jumper from Hasid uh, Gapo. Working for the Cardinals. Arjun, balikan ko lang. Si Christian Bunya is our second leading rebounder sa season ito. He has been working double time after fill out for filling in sa shoes nating two time MVP na All Well Orion last year. Feeling ko after this season, ilalakto ni Coach Ed Cortero sa weights room sa mga hindi mo weights. Lahil nakikita mo eh, he gets to the spots, he can use his length. But when he gets crowded, he talaga siya for And that's the next transition for a big guy who is not lanky, merong naman, pero to be more powerful and explosive sa ilalim. So this year, Coach Martin, he's getting all the confidence he needs oh, to get it. Yes, definitely. Yeah. As you see, Coach Ed Cordero again drinking his signature coffee. <laughs> Dati ako taga-timpla niyan pag natatalo ako sa shooting nun. Marami, marami kami locker room talks okay. ni Coach Ed. Oh, ba nag-timpla nun ngayon? Hindi, hindi. Hindi ako, hindi ako, hindi ako. <laughs> Oh, Tay-Tay. Alapasok hey, 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 scores his first two points of the ball game. That's eight seconds. Here in the first alley you play. That's it, Gabo gets it back. And that's the end of the first quarter. So JR, you have the Bombers with a three-point lead. Neck and neck action. Here's uh, the highlights of the first. Bunyag, the score underneath. He scores po natin Jet Mendoza with 6 for JRU. Kasulig niya dyan si Carl Bordon with 5. Sa kamila naman, JP Nieles, 2 buckets in the first with 4 points. Sunod niya si Christian Bunyag with 3 points and 6 rebounds already for the big guy in itong Mapua University Cardinals. So uh, closing in on his average of 11.9 per game. Our uh, first quarter score 90 to 16 in favor of the JRU Heavy Bombers. Kapalik po. Ang inyong uh, Season 93 ng NCAA.